Wait, we have some drama in the kitchen. Blood, We've uh, blood, 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 blood. Blood everywhere. Oh no. I'm gonna do this, so I need to tidy up and put around here. What a mess. Mullet. I had a mullet once in 1987. It's not a great backdrop, but. What's this? Wait a second. This is not good. Yeah. G'day, my name is Seamus. I'm gonna start my own cooking vlog. Now I know what you're thinking. One, that's probably a pretty silly idea for you, Seamus. Two, can you even cook? Three, why aren't you in a kitchen? Clearly there's some work to do to get organized, to um, become, you know, get my pro vlogging game on. I really struggle with that word, vlogging. Whatever, I'm gonna give it a go anyway. So what am I going to do today? Well, I don't know. I'm not gonna cook anything per se right now. I might actually pop over to my uh, father-in-law's uh, granny flat in the garden because he's got some old mates of his uh, coming to visit. Now, they're all French. Uh, two of them are chefs or were chefs. It seems like a bit of a gastronomical uh, opportunity to go and see what they're cooking. I think perhaps some of the stuff they're cooking might be a little challenging for me. I, my tastes uh, can be a little bit kind of, you know, Aussie. I like uh, meat and potato and they're probably going to be whipping up some stuff that your average foodie would be pretty excited about. Here she is, hello Cherie. Hello, how are you? I'm very well. I'm opening oysters. Now Cherie is opening oysters. I'll tell you one thing that uh, you may find interesting is that I have never eaten an oyster oh. in my whole life. That's very good because it's more for us. <laughs> hello. So uh, Daniel, uh, and Gabrielle there chilling out. So I, I'm an oyster virgin. I'm actually, I've always been rather terrified by the uh, the concept, but um, maybe maybe today is my day to try one. Wait, we have some drama in the kitchen. We have uh, blood. Blood everywhere. Oh no, is that part of the oyster sauce? Yes, uh, sometimes, sometimes it's part of opening oysters. Well, at the moment it's getting on to winter. In summer they spawn. Which means they're very fat, you know, this uh, part here is usually Wait, really big. Uh, right. But most people should, you don't eat them in summer. Oh, okay. You only eat them in winter when they're nice and lean like that. Oh, yeah. So it's oyster season now? Yeah. And I want them to be full of sperm or eggs. Oh, so yeah, he's, he's onto sperm again now. <laughs> what? <laughs> yeah, we have the, the oysters. You have to make sure that the juice doesn't fall out. Because the juice is still got to see. Water in them. Ah, yes, that's part of the flavor experience. Yeah, that's yep. why you don't op buy them open because they wash them. Yep. And so, uh, you are cooking, you're preparing the oysters and you and mullet. Is that the, the lunch that you're making, Daniel, and, uh, today? Yeah, and we've got school, uh, prawns. school prawns. Oh, school so prawns. Tiny little prawns. Mm, uh, just deep fry them. Oh, yeah, nice. Like, like in, the, in the pan. Yes. In the pan. Yes. With garlic and parsley. Garlic and parsley, yes. And flambe. And flambe. Flambe. Yeah. <laughs> Things are heating up in the kitchen. We have the uh, the parsley from the garden has gone in with the the garlic and uh, the green chili. The hot green chili. No, the chili and yeah. the pasta. Yeah. Now comes the, the star of the show. See how I do this? Watch it. Watch it. This is good. The call has gone out for the flambe. The hairs. Look at all the hairs. Oh, look, look at that. Hairy bastards. Yeah, look at that. You're giving me all this, uh, <laughs> Seamus. The cool. As if I just woke up yesterday. From! Yeah. <laughs> They're not cooked yet, just wait. Oh. Okay, and. There we go. Look at that. Fire, fire. I want more flame. 
Yeah. We need more flames. <laughs> no. The last yeah. song, he put too much whiskey. Oh. Oh. I remember you, the last song. Okay. Uh, and what are we drinking? It's tequila. It's uh, Martin Vionnier. Hmm? Martin Vionnier. Uh, Martin Vionnier. Yeah. In, in Europe, it's a very expensive wine from the northern Rome. But it's old vines, very old vines. In Australia, it's uh, Marsan is a typical uh, varietal from Chateau Tabilk and Mitchelton. Uh, um, and so lunch is served. I have never had an oyster before. Shall I? Shall I give it a go? Yeah, yeah. we shall get you a okay. nice little one. Is there, is there a technique? Yeah, you have to take good, the, yeah. Uh, yeah, this one. Do you want a bit of lemon juice on yeah. the floor? Just remove the water, okay. uh, which is in the flesh. Yeah. Why Sorry, you put the water then? Because, because otherwise it's not good, it's too salty. Okay. And we put some lemon for you to start with. And then you bend it down. <laughs> and do I chew it? You don't chew. No, you just swallow it? Yeah, you can chew later. Do your hedge. Et dit, moi je vais prendre les huiles de crabe. Moi aussi, il ne veut pas manger les huiles, il ne les aime pas. Il fait que dès que c'est dans la bouche, il avale. That's delicious. And what are we making? We're making uh, mallet fillets with um, chili and um, big onions. Oh, I've got some coriander, that's right. Yeah. Uh, here's our friends here. Yes, there's your heads. Look at that. Yeah. It took me years to find out what a pick looks like. Oh, he's got a mallet. <laughs> What's a mallet? I, mean, a I knew what this was, but I didn't know what you guys <laughs> called a mallet. He's, he's, got, he's got a pet fish. Yeah, I just found out my tongue. Yeah. And it's a nice hot. Uh, some more chili. Yeah. But that wasn't hot before, wasn't it, with the school board? No, it wasn't very hot. It was good. Laisse-moi tranquille, naturellement. Tu crois que je vais pas faire la cuisine? Mais tu sais bien que tu sais faire la cuisine. Mais pourquoi tu me dis? Mais simplement pour exciter mon Daniel. Mais nous, on a un petit morceau de beurre. Leave me alone. I'm cooking. If you think you want to do something, you can. But si c'est pas bon, te le mets dans la gueule. Don't give me orders. You're gonna put skin down. Make sure you flambe it. No, but par contre, moi ce que je. Now I learned to cook when you weren't even around. Yeah, but they all they all wet your matches. Non, mais c'est d'une qualité dégueulasse. Ils ont qu'à ils ont qu'à importer les peupliers de France pour faire des. It's a lot of oil. Yeah, yes, can I eat it all up? Some butter also. Mm. Always oh, butter. Oh, butter in the French people put butter, butter everywhere. Yeah. Yes. That's a dollar. So the and the butter. Olive oil and the butter. It's okay, there's no carbs in fish. Salt. When you cook fish, always skin down. Skin, skin down. down in the pan. First, yeah, yeah. And how long do you cook the fish for? Uh, not long, probably all together. Two, three minutes on each side. Two, three minutes. Mm. On high or low? Yeah, on high. On high. Yeah. I've got the heads for Daniel. What does he want with the heads? What's he going to do with them? It's it. There's meat inside. He eats the, inside the, the brain and the eye. Really? <laughs> does he cook them? Yeah, I'm going to cook them. Yeah. <laughs> wow. All right. Daniel, tell us about the fish. Fish, fish living in the water. Ah, right. <coughs> very good. But now it's in my plate. It's it very, very good. good. Oh, yeah, the mullet. The mullet. Mm, I might taste some myself. Yes, you do.